Hey everyone, and welcome back to Snowtopia. Yeah, you guys, you guys, uh, thank you so much for your feedback in the first and second episode. Um, if you want to check that out, the playlist is available to the top right now, as always. And today, we are going to work in even more feedback that you guys gave me, and we're going to try a new level in here. Um, oh my god, this is so loud. <laughs> oh my god, this is, this is just in my ears. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, well, never mind. Let's go to a new game. And today we are jumping ahead and we are trying the White Canyon immediately, I guess. Um, these two I failed on. You know what? No, we just take that one again and we start a new game. Because I still have like an open, like an open discussion with this one, okay? So we're going to take this one today and try to beat this to the three stars. Uh, one thing I want to mention though is um, that you gave me the feedback and before we actually talk about that, let me just pause the game to talk you through. Now, you guys said last episode was a little bit too rushed for you. I, you know, I get the feeling um, that I understand what you, where you guys are coming from um, and I definitely want to change this. You also gave me some very good hints in terms of how to make the slopes better and so on. So we're going to start a lot more, you know, chill down, relax today. And I will then skip a little bit in between, maybe cut it out or, you know, just stop the recording. Um, just so we don't need to rush it as much. Um, this was by no means meant to be stressy or whatever. I just enjoyed playing it that way. I just enjoy playing these games this way, to be honest. That's just my way of doing it. But I heard you. And so uh, we are addressing this in a different manner today. So we are going to try to be a bit more strategically orientated today. And we know that it, this uh, area is very specific because we have uh, had a lot of issues with a lot of people at the beginning. So I will very heavily push for some research at the beginning that we can manage to get the gondolas very quick. And we will go to efficiency rather than um, the exp uh, expansion. And I'm going to try to do our best to make it nice. So what I want to do very early on is I want to go to this side over here. This is this is the peak I want to go to the earliest. And then also here. So making sure that we have like a wonderful little arena going down in the middle. So I'm going to focus to make this over here a lot more approachable. And then the back side over here will be a bit more research. And once we feel the need, we can go over here and connect all of this to this side. So I'm just trying to make sure that this is the area we work with. And then um, in order to get some more steep slopes, we have to see what we can address later on. But I think this is the best way of doing it. So let's quickly start by putting down the builder's lodges already. So I'm willing to put again, very, very much a lot of those down because they are very much needed in order to build things rather quickly and so i'm putting down we've got six at the beginning and i'm going to spend putting all of these six in one building um simply because that is giving us the quickest way of building um wait the snow groom is something we need later and then let me see if i can squeeze that somewhere in here not really so i'm going to squeeze that right next to it here just as close as we can, boom, double click, done. So now we do have three of those and I'm going to put these down. What we will do next, I will try to use this area as much as possible. I don't feel like building any kind of slope here, maybe just for the tiny babies now, um, but this is just the beginning. What I will put down though is I will put down a lot of research labs. I think I'm going to start, yeah, as close as possible over here. I'm going to build four research labs, okay? four research labs for us at the very beginning um, because this way I really hope that we can research the quickest possible way. So this is going to start first. Then um, I'm going to give them all priority in building here so that they will build being the first. That's it. And I'm just going to pause the game right now um, for the moment, but now I will hit the play and just a little bit quicker um, simply to make sure that uh, they can build these buildings already. So did I hit play? Is, is the game playing? I guess it is, right? Yeah, they start building. Great stuff. Good. What we also need to do is some um, hangars already for the snow groomer. And I'm willing to put down um, already two at this side over here, just to make sure that we have some groomers at the very beginning we can use. Um, this is very much needed. And then we also need the mechanics shop right next to it. Um, so I'm willing to have already a good little uh, area in the front here with a lot of uh, necessary stuff. And then we also put down the only food we have in the middle, just as like a little, you know, kind of welcoming thing at the very beginning. And since we don't really have that many lifts, we, we do start with a two person lift though. Um, I'm just testing if we can reach up somewhere here. If I stretch it out long, if there's any chance to do this, or if we do have to start over here. I think I, yeah, I just found this over here. I think we are starting with this one first. 
to do it that way um, to make sure that we have something nice on this side and I guess I'm just trying to mirror this on the other side with um, hopefully getting something installed over here yeah that's nice so we are not destroying any of of this area so we can put the gondola right over here and right over there at the next step uh, just making sure that this works and now from over here we draw some gentle slopes first oh my that's not even too gentle that's actually already a little bit crazy um but all right we're just gonna drag this around here and then we will see how the perceived um challenges it's not that challenging though it's actually pretty okay and then we just drag another one from over here just like a little bit more fun funsies for the people you know nothing major just that they can take this little slope making that a bit more approachable and i don't want to go to this back side this is not really needed i wonder if we can do something narrow just going alongside here a little ah that actually somewhat works wait there was like a I can't really oh wait I can look at that that this is working I like this just bringing that legs to it and just connecting over here yeah that, that looks good so we're just gonna have some some pieces next to each other and then we do what we always do we just put the snow patrol lodges down here so that they can go down the road and I hope to put another one just next to it works amazing that's pretty neat. So we have done this. This is just a general setup, okay? So we've done all of that. They built stuff like this, fine. Waiting for some more volunteers soon. Um, let me just put down these lodges right next to it already. Um, and then another lodge goes here. And we are also going to build like a large slope going down. Just some easy stuff at the beginning, you know? Nothing, can I just bring that? No, I can't. Okay, I was just thinking if I can bring this around there, but not really, so we're just going to connect. Well, actually, if I want to have the gondolas here, I just want to have to keep that. Um, now, you know what? I think I bring this back. Uh, it doesn't work. Let's just do it somewhat that way. Yeah, I want to keep it to this side if possible, just to make sure those all looking good. Um, and we have some space over here for the gondolas next. This is, this is something I want to do and just making sure that this works. Okay, so what we will need is a groomer first and... A mechanic as well making sure that those two are done and then we also have to employ well we can actually get rid of one and two and three and now we can just assign them to these uh do we have one left yes perfect okay so now we can put everything in research and what we do first is we do go into the lifts and we, we just spend our time going into the lifts this is the very much most important thing to do we just need to go full on lifts okay so this is what we need to do first um making sure this works and i'm not sure if, if this is just quicker or how much we can schedule can we schedule more no we can't okay i thought maybe it was quicker because of this but um it actually wasn't so that's fine um so we just wait for some more volunteers now um, so I'm just gonna speed this up at this point. I think it's it's not too bad. We don't have any guests yet So we can speed the whole process up. I think this is also one of the key things to do Just do some research first before we get some skiers in because if no skiers are there We basically um, have no issue doing anything. Let me just also get rid of this. Is there a way also to disable this? Just like, like in general, I would love to just disable these tips and tricks, but you know, I don't know uh, we can also uh, the construction and the builder's lodge blob we've done that i don't need to put this down again um you know what i'm gonna skip that over and then i'll be back with you guys all right we're back and i did most of these things already the skier satisfaction is the next bit uh, and now we have to wait for 150 skiers at this point um so i did not go any further than that um just to make sure that we have a gentle pace okay so i just opened that one and we don't have that of big of a queue i put two people in um but we're doing huge progress already in the research department so that's kind of a good thing i'm just gonna speed it up by a little because we need some more volunteers um that's gonna cost us the most time waiting for volunteers to be honest sometimes i think it might make sense at the beginning just to wait for the volunteers um I would really love to see like a little bit of, you know, I think this game has huge potential to grow bigger and having different challenges, you know, at the point we don't have money, so we build without money. I think at some point it would be cool to have 
already all the volunteers available, but then have like a money challenge. I think this would also add a wonderful new layer to it. I mean, you know, I kind of love having this um, challenge of, of, you know, going without money. It's kind of a little bit of a sandbox-ish uh, thing, but you know, this, this kind of type of game would benefit a lot, like a lot majorly from uh, having, you know, just uh, money as a element of uh, management as well. So there's enough stuff happened. Um, I gotta have to put these things into the queue as well. Let's see if we can put the small shelter in the queue as well. I just want to make sure that this is all done and I'm just waiting for the next volunteer. As soon as that one is here, we can basically open this one as well. I think this is uh, pretty much what we need to do at this point. So let's see, this research is going on further, but uh, we're still waiting for the volunteer. And then this looks all very promising. So here we go, we can go to the optimized one. I guess that's the, yeah, I think that's what we do. I think this is, this is a good idea. And now let's go all the way on top here to make sure that we build this as quick as possible out. And we have already the 16 gondola as a next potential thing to plan. We're just gonna do this right now. Uh, this leaps us forward a lot. So we've got the two volunteers, so we can actually open this pistol over here as well. Now having more skiers coming in, joining in of course, testing the new, new skiing routes, which I guess is a great stuff to happen. And yeah, we're just basically waiting for volunteers. This is what we do. I wonder if, if there's a chance to increase this. Welcome, max number of volunteers is 60. 60? I think there was way more in this resort. Maybe it is when I just open up to this area that we then have more, I don't know. I really don't know how that works, to be honest. Maybe maybe that doesn't work, maybe it does work. Um, but what we need is we just need to, first of all, get a person in here. Maybe a second one. See, this is the problem. We are still waiting for so many volunteers. Um, this is why I pushed so much into research. That's pretty much normal, but um, I'm fine with it right now. We do still have the groomer waiting to do some stuff. You know what we could do? We could actually put this... A little bit on like I don't know 60% does this make the route actually perceived harder I can put this on, on blue now I guess that would be easier maybe that's how it works um, you commented that there is like a way of doing it this way so I'm I'm quite uh, interested to see how that works so I'm just gonna still aerodynamic seeds lovely look this is so cool because we're moving um, quite nicely forward and hopefully this will help us giving the gondola next and we can already build the big old gondola going up the hill um, and then we just need more volunteers uh, so at this point we're still waiting for the groomer so let's put another groomer in movement and progress lovely cool this is how you work this is how you do it this is how you do it okay so um, I think the gondola is done in a split second let me have a look Boom, there's, this, there's the gondola. Look, this is cool. We have already the four-person uh, fixed grip chairlift as well. So we are going to definitely use this as well. But I'm first of all going to put <laughs> a flickering gondola. Look, this is beautiful to see. But I saw something happening in yellow. That's fine. I just want to see if there's any chance to bring this up here. No, that's too steep. I mean, this is this is already a perfect spot to go. Very nice. We can do some stuff from over here. And I'm just hoping that we can... Maybe, wait, which kind of slope does it have? It's like 40 degrees. What is that one? 43. I think maybe, I'm not sure if it works. It's just like a little test here. Uh, whatever. I'm just going to try to shot. Okay. Well, I don't even know what I could use then over here. Maybe we got to have to build it from, from this spot. I don't know. To shot, to rock or whatever. No. Okay. It's, it's not, it's not good. Anyways, that's, that's now our, not our big issue here. So the big issue will be ooh, how to... Mm. I wonder if it is better to squeeze in the, the skiing route first, but... Oh, I did push it down. Push it down, push it down to steep. Ooh, I can only go here. That's not really where I would love to go, to be honest. I would love to go way more than here and it's blocked by two. I think it's better to build first of all the route down. Yes. Problem queue is that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna resolve that one rather quickly gonna put the gear reducer on um that's that should speed things up already and we can no 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 no, not yet sorry no volunteer needed skier satisfaction done good stuff so let's slow it down for a couple of seconds thank you see there we go this is already what we have we can just quickly open the resort window and the next two steps are the usual one so we are doing good we're doing good on this um 
Very straightforward, to be honest. I did not expect it to go that well. But okay, so we, we have to first of all get this done. I think what we will do over here, we're just gonna take it simple. We're gonna delete this one and exchange it with a four person lift. I think this is the easiest way of doing it. So let's just put this one away and we're just gonna build exactly this. Just, just kind of change it nice and we give it highest priority. Do we still have builders by the way? Just put these builders in place just to make sure. There you go. And we can hit play again and they will be building this. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Just run over here for the moment and then I'm going to exchange this one. That's totally fine. How about research? Oh, look, we nearly missed out on this. So I'm just going to give him all the research needed and required. And I guess the next bit will be into training. But first of all, focus on the lifts. That's really the most important thing. So we don't have the cues and we have a good push through of skiers. Look, I want to make this area out down here very, very, very cramped. You know, I want to have a lot of stuff going on here. This is really a target I'm, I'm aiming for. I'm going to put it like a... Ah, da, I thought I could be... There, there could be a small shelter placed down here, but apparently not. Um, where do you put the small shelter then? I want to make this, this lower area look really like a nice resort this time. Like really focusing on it. Um, okay, so here we go. Just reopen that. Everyone storm over please, because that's where you need to go skiing now. And yeah, I can't really do much about this one, which uh, hopefully will change next. Gosh, guys, I want to go skiing so badly, even though these are like the old ones, but I'm, I'm still fine with this. Um, yeah, while we were waiting, while, while, wow, wow, while we are waiting for this to, to sort out itself a little bit, you know what, we can actually, while we do so, everyone needs to go over, that's fine. We're just going to put the, uh, let's go here, and then I'm gonna just easily put this. Wait, area too steep? Are you, like, what? What? That makes no sense. Um, I'm gonna delete this for a second because that might be the issue. And then we're going, but this gradient is 30 degrees. This is 35 degrees. There's no point that this can't work. So wait, um, this needs to be somewhat here. And now, well, it doesn't matter where I really connect this. Does it? No, it doesn't. Okay, now it is connected. Uh, the only thing is that I need to, yeah, just delete this and build a new one. I think it's easier. <laughs> I'm just too lazy to keep it there and connect it, reconnect it. How does it work down here? Did it work? It did work. Okay, well, that's fine. That's totally fine. Good. Okay, so skiers are coming in, volunteers coming in, research is happening. Love that. Um, can we also go into service training? Yeah, this is all good. That that's the next stuff we are going to research. I'm really, I'm really curious if this is the way to go. Like, I could even build more research stations and then we would be even faster. But I think for the moment, four is kind of okay. Um, problem queue still building closed. As long as this is the only issue, that's all fine. Did I give them the yeah gear reducer is working? Let's put one people or one person in here. That's nice. Blue, blue, blue. Everything is blue. Dabba dee dabba. <laughs> okay, is that green? Yeah, at least we have one green slope. That's very good indeed. How's the process on that one? Forty-three percent. Good. While we wait for that, we are just building a slope down here. Like first of all, starting as always with the large one. I want to give this like a very nice go to the center here, if possible, because this is where I want to make sure that we have like the connection with all the different slopes. And now we go down and make it a bit more of a. Actually, we we could try to keep that a little bit more gentle, if somehow possible. I want to make sure that this is really a gentle little thing to take and then uh, give them the chance to enjoy this one. Like really bringing that like a little bit of a story driven, uh, story driven is kind of the, the wrong word, but like a, like a bit more of a nice gentle slope that brings you down and connects the whole resort with each other, you know, because if we build like another one that goes down here, reconnects in and then takes that one. This is how it is in like in real skiing resorts anyways. And then we give that one down that I would take all of the times, the one below the lifts. <laughs> I, I just love these. I don't know why. I just love me some some good old. Uh, mostly, I'm. Um, this is like kind of in the deep snow, and there is not like this. This piss is not uh, prefab or done by any groomer. So I love having some more natural ones like this. And this is kind of my stuff. I love to do. And then what we also can do is put down a more. No, oh, well, oh, look at that. We can make like a little speedway, like a black speedway. Oh, I love that. 
that's a cool one. Just like speeding down the hill. M maybe you could even have like a kind of a speed trap down here. That would be nice if that's kind of a thing. I would love to get, get this, you know, speed trap thingies, fun parks. There's so much you can do with this game. Skier's waiting for his assistant. Uh, well, actually, makes sense because I... Yeah, well, there you go. <laughs> Just making sure that this works. Um, and also, we haven't done... We can... And that should be fine. Um, the skier assistant should be resolved rather quickly. And how about the research in general? Okay, we're still doing good on research. How is the... Still not done. Okay, we should speed up the process a little bit at least. And then um, we can also put down, if possible... Can I squeeze it in somewhere over here? I want to have at least one groomer. There was one position I could put it... Yeah, well, then fine. But I'm going to put like a groomer on top here as well. And then uh, we get this little guy next to this one. I guess two of them make sense over here. Oh, gosh. Okay. Then, then we do it that way. Um, because that's fine. I'm going to put the small shelter. I want to connect this as much as possible. So we can put more buildings after each other that makes sense if that yeah that works okay cool we can this is all blocked which makes sense and i'm gonna put this down here <laughs> i mean okay will be kind of tricky to get there but i think it's fine it's fine good okay so we are still not synchronized boarding yes this works this is all good oh look we can open that one up Nice. Can I open this up, please? Oh, wait, I have to wait for a spot. Now, well, that's an instant click, though, but still. Um, how many volunteers do we have? Okay, so we have this. Now, let's open this with two, because I feel like a lot of people might go here. We can still get more people in if needed. Um, and we are going to reopen this one as well. Good. So now the skiing resort should see a lot change, because now everything is reopened. Um, we should get a lot more traffic. Let's have a look. This should actually now raise a lot and oh look we increased the max numbers of volunteers. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Look you can also see with the skier over here is on a green slope is on a chairlift is in the queue at a ski lift. Well, this is obviously a bad thing, but um, now we shouldn't have too many queues anymore. Nice. Okay. Well, we have actually researched a lot. Is there a better upgrade? Not yet. Let's have a look if we can click open it. Yes, we can. And then we can go into the emergency break and we also go into the simplified gondola next. That should be fine. All right. I'm going to skip a little bit ahead, guys. So we see some progress also in research and so on. And then we see how we can solve some more issues. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back and you can see my overall satisfaction is at an all time low, but um, this this has a reason and we are going to address this uh, now because I have invested a lot of time into basically, as you can see, finishing the research mostly. Um, We're just going to uh, research a few little things here as, you know, getting some food in and so on. Um, there's not much we can still research in terms of efficiency and that's a good thing uh, because as you can see, we um, have a lot of spree free slots here in the volunteers and we've got um, eight people working in research right now so what we are going to do now we're going to make sure that everything is running pretty much as efficient as it can be I changed a whole bunch about the re um, about the uh, wonderful little lifts over here because even the far people chairlift did not work out well enough so you can see there's a whole bunch of traffic going on here um, so we still have some free air uh, on both of them to put one more person in, in in case there's some issues happening and you can see that we are still having a lot of issues here with um, some people falling down so what I'm doing right now I put this for example into a red um, area and this is not on 100% I'm actually putting that to 90% making sure that they maybe do not fall down anymore um, what the the good thing about this is though that you can see that the challenge is actually um, a lot more higher uh, for most of them which is pretty good um, and you can see that only these uh, snowplough uh, people here they don't really like it as much because we don't have enough people but what we're going to do now is we are investing a lot of uh, time and money um, into having more snow groomers of course um, making sure that we can address this better um, this is I think a good thing but what we also need to do is putting these snow groomers also in places well, actually, I wanted to put that somewhat up here, but it seems not really to get anywhere, as it seems. Well, then we got to have to put it uh, somewhat uh, more down. Oh, we actually have the work schedule and the onboard scanner now. Oh my god, I need to fix this for all of them now. 
uh, with the onboard scanner so that's kind of cool because then you can fix those issues a bit better so you know what i'm doing right now is making sure that all of these pistons have uh, the best possible uh, security and all that kind of stuff you know that, that you can easily do um there's not much left for me at this point you can see up here we also have a lot of stuff uh, happening um, i want to do more but for the moment being this is the way we go you can see there are a lot of uh, nice pists but people do not take this um, as much as they could because there's not enough gentle stuff for them so i'm adding some more gentle slopes for the people because i, I think this is what they this is what they want so what we're going to do we add a more gentle slope to this area over here um, so just that we have a bit more of a bluish slash greenish one, you know, nothing in particular crazy, just making sure that the people have a bit more variety here. Um, this is what we put in here and then we will open up this area to the right hand side. Somehow I will be able to put stuff down, up there. I'm, I'm quite confident we will be able. So at this point we have the 16 people and the 12 people gondola. The 12 people gondola is my, uh, my element of hope, so to say. I really hope that we can do it with this one, even though I have not figured yet where to put it, to be honest. Um, I mean, it doesn't work on this side because, well, I would it would be blocked there. That's kind of a little pity. I mean, I could try to area to steep for building. What? You're kidding me, right? It must work somewhere over here. Wait, there we go. So now we have to find a spot where to bring it down. And this is, I think, the biggest issue we'll have. Um... This is too steep for building. Oh my god, my good plan, guys. My plan seems to not work out. Uh, 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 this is all too steep. Can I at least bring it somewhere? This is too short. How about bringing that over here? <laughs> that does, does this work somehow? I think it would work if I... Uh, see, this is, this is the little issue. But I think it would actually work this way. Huh. This is kind of the question. I mean, we can squeeze it through like this, you know? Area too steep to building. Oh, no, 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 no. I have the feeling we might need to relocate this one. I think that it is. It is. Um, I'm going to delete this. We have to move this way. We have to make this move stick, okay? So we have to kind of bring this one down. And then... You're just telling me this is all too steep. That's not possible. Okay, we have to find the spot again where it works. Ooh. Where were you? I found you. There was there was a spot where it worked. There you go. This is the spot. Wait, this is the spot. So I'm going to bring it down and just hoping area too steep. No, 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 no. It's not too steep. It's too steep, you say? What? Okay, that's a little bit of a pity because I really thought we would be able to get there. Um yeah that's that's a little bit of an issue to be honest i thought we would be able to what about putting this here is this someone working too steep that doesn't work either too short this works well then we're gonna go with this that's fine and then we just need to figure out how we will bring this one uh ooh, 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 this will not work this way right uh, i guess the easiest way would be to just plop that one down here and then just kind of find our way down into this area. Oh my god. Uh, this is going to be even more tricky. Can I connect? I, I, I think I could connect this, right? Just having no lift at all there might make sense. I don't know. I don't know, guys. This is, this is a bit tricky. A bit more tricky than I thought it was. Um, what about now? Can we just... This lift is blocked by... What is it blocked by, by this building? Can I delete this building? Just move out, okay? I'm SpaceX. I, I ask you to move out. <laughs> it's not gonna work. Okay, well, but this, this thing is inevitable. We need this one. Um, and we need these slopes. Okay, so the question I have is, can we... The question really is, can I bring a slope that way? Oh, it works. Wait a second, it works. I mean, at least this is something. Um... So at least we have connected them. This is kind of nice. So at least we have the people go over. But I'm still pretty much wanting a lift over there. Okay, well, I think going down to a four... Yeah, that works. Okay, cool. So this should do the trick. Uh, we now have this one going up here. This one here, making a few more slopes working. 
having these buildings all over there, that makes a lot of sense. And then we are also going to have these snow patrol buildings all the way up here. Even though I think we should definitely try to benefit from this position here with some restaurants and so on. Because that's a nice little thing. Anyways guys, I'm gonna make like a little skip here. I'm gonna build this all and then I'll be back with you. Hey there, and welcome back. I actually have no idea where we stopped because the game crashed for the first time ever. It crashed for me, and um, well, we are basically researching at this very point the last thing that is needed in here. Uh, but what we are also doing, we are trying to get our stars up high, and therefore we need to give them a lot more shelter. So what I'm going to start with now is giving the people, first of all, a lot of large shelter. So we're gonna go through this a little bit more now uh, with a bit more of a structure. I'm gonna make it half speed to not get the game too crazy. Um, so what I want to do, I want to put these large shelter buildings everywhere now, where it is possible. And then um, we are first of all going to check that they have enough spaces to really you know, enjoy themselves and get a bit of rest. That's the most important thing, that everywhere we go, um, we have some place to rest for our people because energy seems to be on a very low level and we don't want that. So we want the people to be um, very happy and not very tired. And so we are going to give them the big large shelter where it belongs. And this is basically everywhere where we can squeeze it in. <laughs> um, so yeah, well, just giving it to them uh, how they like it is very important. So I'm gonna put another one here, that should be fine. You can see all of them are going to be built. Now we can also put down some more resistant buildings for the people so that they don't fall down. Uh, I think because we don't really have that many down here, we are just going to quickly squeeze them in between before we put down the, uh, I think fast food restaurant will be the next one and the panoramic one to, to the top here which is this, the next bigger thing I'm gonna build. Um, so this is the panoramic restaurant. Let me place this. I, you know, I'm, I'm placing that in the center. If you don't stop, I mean, <laughs> this is like exactly the wrong side, but okay, well, okay. No, it's not okay. I, no, 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 We can't do this. People need to be able to look down the hill, right? So we can't, can't put it here. Wait, wasn't there like a yellow bit here? I, I just saw it being yellow here for a split second. Uh, come on. I, I get that little yellow bit. Come on. I saw it. I saw it. I'm just gonna click. Uh, well, then then just no, I guess. Can I? Well, put it there. At least something. Okay, that's at least something. Um, okay. Well, next up is this right hand side over here. I'm not sure if I will be able to... Well, it does technically fit in there, but this is this area is too steep, you tell me. How about connecting this here somewhere? Not really, is that, like, I can still squeeze that in the center. That's kind of nice. There's not really much space to rotate. Okay, well, we, we keep it that way. This this is kind of a nice view anyways, you know, over there. That's fine, I'm gonna squeeze that in. Um, so that should make them a lot more happy. Uh, while they are waiting, we can also put these things down. I'm not even sure if I did upgrade all of the buildings because we received so many updates, even some of them I haven't seen before, so that's kind of nice anyway. So I'm gonna put one person there. Why is that not connected? Did we break it? Wait, how and why? I didn't, I, I never know when, when this happened. Uh, excuse me? Can I? Is that because of this building? Let me just delete that. No. What, when, when did this happen? Did we break it with this building? We can also delete that, but no. Okay. That is interesting, because usually it should work. I mean, it's definitely, it definitely worked. Um, uh, uh, okay. Well, I guess I'm just gonna del delete this. And now I'm just hoping that we can squeeze that back in, but honestly, I have no clue what that was. Um, so yeah, that is, that is the, that's the position where we were. I'm just not sure if that works, to be honest. Well, there was like a little bit of a yellow thingy. I, I saw it. No, 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 it is possible. I saw it. I'm just going to click until, I, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Whatever that was, it's okay. We fix it. Um, that was a bit weird. Okay. never mind. Never mind. I just hope that the, 
uh, devs are watching it and maybe look into what that is because that kind of keeps happening to me that sometimes out of nowhere things just all of a sudden um, are disconnected which is which is weird it shouldn't happen um, okay shall we also put like another snow groomer hunger down I don't even know if we need it to be honest we can just keep it that way because it seems all pretty nice at the moment so reputation is going up everything is going to go up which is which is good um, as soon as all of that is built I'm gonna give this the attendance should not be too high at this point but uh, I guess it's gonna get higher as soon as we give them the chance to go there I really hope that works um, so let's see if we can squeeze something else in here like a fast food restaurant nice and we also squeeze a soup bar that should fit right in the middle here just to connect those areas nice stuff that's nice can we also give them like a smaller shelter next to this area no but there's one we can just put some down for them to have fun and then down here we're gonna give them fast food restaurant and we're gonna give them yeah why not have another panoramic restaurant down here Gonna give them also a supa, soup soup, soup supa. Nice. Is there anything else we can give them? Like the self-service restaurant? Why not? Right? Can we squeeze that? Wait, there's yeah. Let's put that. This is like this is like how it looks in a real skiing area, right? Let people. I mean, I don't need to put that many people in. Just give them the chance to rest for a moment. But um, okay, waiting for a builder. You tell me. Well, there are two builders. Wait, why is this not... Okay, well, there's just... Should be enough builders at this point. How about on here? That's all good. It's all good. There's also not ma massive traffic over here. We can basically just give them a small shelter, if possible. Just build that there. And maybe also, like, a small fast food restaurant. Yeah, that should be fine. You know, they shouldn't be too needy. I guess that's, that's pretty much what they need. Also, why not put, like, a builder's lodge on top here? Just so we have some more builders right in here. Boom. One more builder. It doesn't really matter, right? We can we can just do it as we want. And we're going to put also like a snow patrol building down to this side. Just so we have it. I know, it's quite a bit of work here. Um, and I'm going to skip this real quick with you guys. So uh, as soon as I'm back, these should be all built. And then let's see if we can improve the star rating. Alrighty, everything is built. And we g just briefly um, got the reputation three stars. I really don't know why it wasn't displayed. It, it just all of a sudden crashed down. Um, as soon as I opened all these buildings, it just completely skyrocketed to nearly even four stars real briefly. And then it all went back. But we, we just made it. So I'm quite happy. And as soon as I click the uh, ski resort over here, boom. No, actually, this is not the resort window. Uh, is it that one? I guess this is. And there you go. We actually um, made it. So we also finally made this level work, even though that the reputation is not shown correctly over here. But um, you know, I wanna, I wanna not, uh, you know, uh, put too much thoughts into that because I, the only thing I know is that this reputation or like this resort over here might be the most realistic we've built so far, and I'm quite in love with it, to be honest. I, I really like it, and I also have to say, um, at this point, we could just wait for a whole bunch of more. Um, volunteers because you can see there's basically nothing going wrong right now which is pretty crazy we can just open all of these things I also figured that most of these buildings there's one person in here is fully enough like the attendance in these buildings is just like nearly none you know there's basically no one actually in there I'm not sure if this is because they are not really to the roadside and I cannot really access it I'd love to really understand if that's the case because I, I never saw anyone being in here to be honest uh, I think they really have to be next to the slopes I've not seen them going to these buildings like this one seems to work but all of the others just don't so I'm not sure if that even works if I connect it I mean they do as you can see they do go here and there is some kind of attendance but I am not really too sure so I'm going to put all of the people in now. Do I have three free spots? No. We've got to wait for two more so that we just at least have everything opened. That's my little target over here. Okay, so I'm gonna briefly open this one too. And we can also get the upgrades to that one. Yeah, there's one free spot. There's one building left, guys. One building is left for the full glory of our skiing resort. And I'm gonna fully take this even though it's not displayed, but I'm, I'm quite sure that our reputation is better than that because, I mean, we, yeah, I mean, just look at that. We made most of the people pretty happy, so that's fine. Um, I, I, I guess 
to make him even more happy, you need some more gentle slopes. I don't know what exactly would help out on making this really like displayed over here. I think the display is not really thinked with the real reputation you gain. Um, and it seems for me personally a little bit too hard. Um, just being completely honest here. Because, I mean, this skiing result is like quite realistic, I gotta say. Um, and it really does not fulfill what it should. And so, yeah, you know, I'm just going to build one super simple slope here. Just like for the walking lullabies, or how would they be called? So just gonna. <laughs> this is like one of the most generic and easy slopes I've ever built, I guess. So let's bring this down. Look, this is this is like simple as it can be. Uh, we can also just grab another one from from here. Just give it them like another little slopey slope. <laughs> That's so simple. I would never take this one. It's just like the most boring thing in the world. But whatever. So I'm gonna. Give them also here a bit more challenging one that connects over there. Nice. Um, yeah, we should also have the snow patrol. <laughs> the paw patrol. Paw patrol snow patrol should be next to it. So gonna put these uh, next here. There you go. Let's wait for these two builds to be finished and then um, yeah, I think we're gonna call it a day with today's build. Uh, we mastered the second level and the next one will be to three stars difficulty and I'm really hoping that we can make a good impression on that one too. So yeah, um, guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's build. I certainly did enjoy this uh, quite a bit, I gotta say. Um, look at this. Look at our wonderful, wonderful little uh, resort over here. I Again, as I said, I think this is my most uh, nice one so far. Let me know as well, guys, in the comments down below if you think this is the best one. And I want to know one thing from you guys. Um, in fact, which is your favorite skiing area? Um, in case if you go... Uh, do skiing where do you go and what's your favorite skiing resort i really want to know because for me personally it's oberstdorf in germany this is by far my my most favorite one uh kanzelwand and fellhorn is is my place to go this is my beloved little place even though i like uh, driving at the even uh, even as well um very nice area but um yeah that's kind of my little home area if you will and i want to know from you guys what do you think but anyways this is it for today i will be live streaming tonight a planet zoo in case you want to see that one come over to twitch you find the link in the description as always and if you want to see more of uh this wonderful game you can click the playlist uh, to the top right info bubble it's in here i hope you enjoyed today's episode i hope you enjoyed me taking it a bit more gentle for you leave me some feedback if that's a better solution I would be more than happy to read that. And now, stay safe, everyone. I talk to you in the next one. Goodbye.